Everyone seems to think a controller can instantly improve your skills. The controller is just insane, man. The guy is just like a one clipping motherfucking bubble fight. The controller's aim assist is pretty much the same thing as cheating, so who the f cares? But is this really true? I'm gonna test that. But first, you need to know why people think controller is actually overpowered. Bro, if you were alive in the times before the Fortnite Kid era, you know games that used a controller had aim assist that only slowed down when you hovered over your opponent. It would help you make precise shots. It was the perfect balance. This whole thing should be. This made games extremely enjoyable to controller players because they could use their pre-developed baby hands to shoot with the joystick accurately. But fast forward a few years and one of the biggest games of all time was released that broke so many records. Fortnite. This set the standard for crossplay in other games which revealed the issue of aim assist on controllers against M&K players. But how does this relate to Apex? Because around this time, a thing called rotational aim assist was becoming bigger too. But what is that? It's when you're strafing and or an enemy is strafing, then the game will correct your aim to a certain degree. Essentially, the game does a lot of the aiming for you. You just make small adjustments. And trust me, you're gonna be good. To be a bad roller player, you'd physically have to be born with the world's smoothest brain to not know how to slightly adjust your aim or you're just fighting the aim assist. Sounds crazy, right? But some of y'all might be saying, what does he know? He's just an MNK player that uses his arm. He's a hater. What you don't know is the percentage of Apex players that are controller is 65% minimum. It's gotten so bad that multiple pros have switched to controller just so they won't go broke. I just don't see a point to stay on MNK. I'm getting like more frustrated than than anything playing on MNK because it feels like everybody that I fight is on roller, so I'm just like at a natural disadvantage anytime I peek into anybody. This may seem like he's being dramatic, but he's not. The top preds are all controller. Open your f eyes, guys. Clearly, there is something good about this input. Now, to be clear. I personally do not care about this issue because whatever I say doesn't affect what happens in the game. Neither does anything anyone else says. I'm just making people understand what is really happening in their game. Even with all this information that I've given you, I know people will still refuse to accept the truth. But you don't have to listen to me. Just listen to all your favorite pros. The 1v3, I mean, what happened? I don't know. I'm controller. I just shot my gun. Um, especially on a game like... Apex, I feel like the emesis is really strong, um, or strong enough. You'd be probably the best in the world if he isn't cheating, and he just like full committed to roller. And I was, I just wasn't sure if you'd know him or not. That's scary. Predict in the next year we'll have like 75% rollers with 25% yeah, MK. Okay, now let's stop complaining about everything and actually give a solution to where rollers and MKs can play together in harmony without all this. Yeah, I actually don't have a solution, but I do have a theory on why Roller is so strong on Apex, and it's money. You see, there are many benefits of having this in your game. It could lead to increased player attention. I know you have that one dog friend who just randomly beams, or their game IQ isn't there, but somehow they can still kill people and hit their shots. Apex understands by giving most NPCs this power, they feel that they can compete and enjoy the game, which will result in increased in-game purchases. It'll also broaden the player base, making competitive way more appealing. But who gives a f about what I'm talking about? We're here for the proof to see if controller actually increases your skill. So I'll show you. Before I went into a real game, I went into the firing range to test out all the other things first. A lot of people complain because they can't do the same movement as M and K on roller, so I looked up a quick movement guide. I stayed on the 4-3 sense just so it would be realistic to how I'd play in the game, and to my surprise, it was pretty easy. In fact, if you're on PC, you can do every single movement technique as M and K, and some of them you can even do even better. Let me remind you though, I've never played on controller before. I just watched a roller movement video and it was pretty easy to do from there. Next test was aim on range dummies. At first I didn't really get how to get that sweet aim people were talking about on the bots, but then I realized I was fighting the aim assist way too much. You see, aim assist has a zero MS response time, so before I'm even physically able to react myself, the aim assist will have already adjusted. So I simply just stopped trying to aim as hard and just aim with my joystick lighter and it was working way better. The last thing I tested before the real game was recoil control, and I was amazed at how easy it was. No, I'm just playing. That was MNK. Here's my actual roller recoil control. Okay, okay, not bad for the first day. Last was my in-game play. Let me remind you guys, everything has a learning curve, so I can't be just instantly good. So you dumb mother who want to come from my neck because I can't one-clip everyone, don't even try. I gotta put on the bot skin for this. Perfect.
He's landing on us. Let's do this. Controller player. Come on, guys, let's go. Why are they standing in place like robots? Hello? Okay. Oh, controller player. Oh my god, can my teammates help me? How do I zoom? Oh sh. Oh. All right, guess it's one v three time. Help me! Help me! Oh. How do I? Oh. What is this? On crouch. What is happening? Okay, fastest armor swap in the world. Nice. Honestly, after playing it for two games, it didn't seem that hard. I just couldn't remember all my buttons. That being said, do you think controller is broken? Let me know. But if you're a real man like me, you need to join this Discord to learn the secrets of MK God Aim Fast or join just to have fun.